Monday, Standard & Poor's published a commentary titled, The Debt Ceiling Debate is Unlikely to Change the AA Plus U.S. Sovereign Rating. It looks at the current debate in Washington and discusses its potential impact on the AA Plus rating and stable outlook we assign to the U.S. government. I shall briefly summarize the points we made. In our opinion, the current impasse over the continuing resolution and the debt ceiling creates an atmosphere of uncertainty that could affect confidence, investment, and hiring. However, as long as it is short-lived, we do not anticipate the impasse to lead to a change in the sovereign rating. This sort of political brinkmanship is the dominant reason our rating is no longer AAA. Standard & Poor's stable outlook indicates that we believe there is a less than a 1 in 3 chance of a rating change over the next two years. The outlook was changed to stable from negative earlier this year, primarily in light of three factors. The government's success in negotiating a compromise that lessened the impact of the so-called fiscal cliff, the decline in the general government deficit to half of its 2011 level with projections of further declines through 2015, and finally, the strengthening economic recovery. These developments suggest to us the potential for further compromise and allow more time in deciding upon further fiscal adjustments. Also, most sovereigns find it easier to adjust when the economy is stronger. Failure to raise the debt ceiling is not in Standard & Poor's base case assumptions. If the debt ceiling were not raised by the mid-October date, when the stopgap measures employed in recent months are estimated to be exhausted, the United States will not be able to meet all of its obligations. Should the government fail to service a debt obligation, we would lower the sovereign rating to SD, which stands for Selective Default. Standard & Poor's would analyze the changes in the political and economic landscape in determining a post-default rating. The key supporting factors for our AA plus rating on the U.S. are a diversified and resilient economy, extensive monetary flexibility, the U.S. dollar status as the world's premier reserve currency, and the willingness to use economic policy countercyclically and decisively as seen in the 2008-2010 monetary and fiscal measures to bolster the U.S. financial sector and economy and support liquidity globally. The key constraining factors on the rating are political brinkmanship that has become more acrimonious in recent years, in our opinion, a budgetary process that separates spending and funding decisions, and a high level of general government debt, which under most forecasts will begin to rise in a few years. Thank you.